Hello, Roboteers! Welcome to the Robotics Parlor. Today we're going to have a talk about the birds and the bees of making baby robots. The University of Cambridge is making great strides in robotic evolution. It's built a robot that builds other, smaller robots. The big robot is called the mother robot, and all the little robots it builds are called children. Now what it does is it takes little cubes with motors inside and then puts them together in different configurations. Then the motors are turned on and the mother robot records and observes how the children robots move and then it tries to make them move faster and more efficiently. The way it does this is by making many iterations of these smaller child robots and it will look at the different traits of different configurations and then alter them to make the robots move faster. If it sees something is very successful, it'll take the successful traits and add them to less successful designs, or it will continue to mutate that successful design to try to make it even better. The system uses artificial intelligence and actually has very few instructions beyond its artificial intelligence program. It's basically told how to put them together in very vague terms and then how to observe them and that its goal is to make them faster. After about 10 generations, the child robots were two times faster than they were at the first generation. Now, this sort of thing has been done before, but it's only been done virtually and simulated. This is the first time an actual machine is working on this type of problem. And it's really interesting because the mother robot comes up with novel solutions that human designers wouldn't come up with because of our natural biases, or would be very unlikely to come up with. This type of research is interesting, not only because it impacts the future of design, but also because it informs our scientific understanding of evolution. Thanks for joining me in the robotics parlor. Please check out our sponsors, MN Drive, links below, as well as links to the story. And I hope you have a roboterific day. Mm -hmm.